come face to face with death more times than I can count. As a Salem PD detective, it's my job to catch killers. But in all my years on the force, I never saw this case coming. Ronan O'Connor is a homicide detective with a criminal past. Guilty on two counts of grand theft dollar. On the indictment of burglary. Grand larceny. And assault with a deadly weapon. But just when he'd started turning things around, he lost everything. Including his life. But none of us can move on to the next world until we finish what we need to in this world. You're here to resolve something. You don't resolve it, you don't leave. In Salem, a town with a dark history, there's a killer on the loose. Ah! He's killed before, and he'll kill again. This crude drawing of a bell has been left at the scene of several murders. Leading police to refer to the murderer as the Bell Killer. Ronan couldn't stop him in life. But in death, he's got a second chance. Hidden somewhere is a trail that leads to his killer. He just has to find it. Ronan has lost the ability to question witnesses, interrogate suspects, and interact with the physical world. But he's gained abilities that are even more valuable. Your strengths in life are stronger in death. They become powers here. Ronan's death gives him the ability to pass through walls, a freedom that quickens his search for the killer. But not everything is open to Ronan. Dusk objects, echoes of tragic events which leave powerful, everlasting imprints cannot be passed through. Hidden in this purgatorial world are hundreds of clues about Salem, its history, and its people. Some of the deceased remain trapped as well, and each has a story to tell. I can't remember what happened to me. Combining everything he finds here is the only way Ronan can uncover the full mysteries of Salem. But not all spirits in the Dusk world can help. Some will stand in his way. Demons will devour any soul they can. Evade them at all costs. But if you can't, then eliminate them. Not all among the living are blind to the Dusk or Ronan. You can see me? You're a medium. Gaining the trust of a partner from the living world would be an invaluable asset for Ronan. My mother has been missing for a few days. I know the bell killer had something to do with her disappearance. But he must use this advantage to find his killer quickly, as time is running out. Ronan will need to use the skills he honed in life and the abilities he gained in death to put an end to the killing. He can possess any living being and hear their inner private thoughts. How can one guy do this? See through their eyes to reveal vital clues and influence their actions. Progressing deeper into his journey, Ronan will acquire new and more powerful abilities. Abilities that will help him traverse and survive the Dusk World to bring him closer to the truth about his murder. Why him? Why that night? Was he just in the wrong place at the wrong time? Or was there something more at work? There are clues that have been left in the bloody wake of the Bell Killer. Like any good detective, Ronan must gather evidence and establish what is relevant. To aid him, he can utilize a new ability he gained in death the power to see and hear past events. By piecing these clues together, he can reveal hidden truths. But the answers Ronan finds only lead to more questions. As the killer's trail spreads, a bizarre mystery is beginning to unfold. Something sinister is at work. But how many more will die before Ronan can stop it?